If you thought Deadpool and Wolverine and the Fantastic Forecast announcement was all Marvel had for us this week, well, they just told us to hold our beer again because they've got a trailer for the X-Men 97 animated series, and I'm going to take a look at this one next. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's the Outlaw John Roca. Thanks so much for clicking play on this trailer reaction. Really excited to be diving into this first official trailer for X-Men 97, the new animated series that's picking up where the X-Men animated series, the legendary one, left off here. And this one is essentially functioning as a sixth season for the show. For those of you who know, it ran in the mid-90s there from 92 to 97. Well, early to mid-90s, I guess you would say. And the new trailer apparently has these X-Men members, Cyclops, Wolverine, Morph, Rogue, Beast, Gambit, Jubilee, Bishop and more picking up the pieces after, of course, what happened at the end of season five, which is the death of Professor X. Spoiler. So, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna, uh, interested to see what we're going to get from this thing and, and what the animation style is going to be. We've seen, obviously, some some clips and some shots and whatever. And is the theme going to come back? I know so many people love that X-Men 97 animated theme, which is, in fa which is fantastic. So I'm very curious to see what we're going to get from this one. So let's not waste any time. Let's bring this trailer up here and let's take a look at this first Official trailer for X-Men 97. Watch the series finale of X-Men next Saturday morning. <laughs> Smart. Local listings. I'm grateful to have the chance to say goodbye. Oh, man, that I animation. I proud of you all, my X-Men. Oh. Fate lies in our hands. Look now. at all of them. Now. Leave a magneto. Now. Oh, nice. Oh, wow. We have to stay vigilant. The professor entrusted us with his dream. Oh, wow. Oh, they're no matter how dark it is. They're imitating the style. Smart. They're updating it, but still matching the pace. Other. Oh. Yeah. We get this done by working together as a team. Jeez, Bob. Keep buzzing in my ear. <laughs> oh! Yeah, Jubilee. Nice. Hey. That's awesome. To me, my X-Men. Oh! There it is. Wow. Magneto, the last will and testament of Charles Xavier. Everything he built now belongs to me. Oh! Interesting twist. Oh, wow. Okay, I like that. That was good. I mean, as I said in the... In the trailer there, very much matching the animated style that they had uh, from that series back in the 90s, updating the look and the cleanness of the lines in the animation, but the style and the kind of uh, jittery movements, that kind of stuff is still there. Uh, in how they did the animation. So I thought that was pretty cool. Looks like we're going to a lot of places uh, in this thing here as, as well. And they've got a cast list that they announced for this. I want to give some love to the people involved with this. Ray Chase as Cyclops. Jennifer Hale, who I think is one of the best people working in voiceover today. One of the most sweetest people. She's there doing Jean Grey. Allison Seely Smith as Storm. Cal Dodd as Wolverine. J.P. Karliak friend of mine there as Morph, Lenore Zan as Rogue, George Booz as Beast, AJ uh, Lacasio as Gambit, Holly Chow as uh, Jubilee, Isaac Robinson Smith as Bishop, Matthew Waters as Magneto, and Adrian Hoff as Nightcrawler. So that's a stacked voiceover cast. If you know anything about animated voiceover work, that is a stacked cast for animation and voiceover. So I'm really excited to see what they're going to do with, with this. And I like this idea that Bo DeMeo, who's the writer here, I like what they are showing us here, that they're going to come together after uh, Charles Xavier's death. How are they going to come together as a team? How are they going to work together as a team? We see the Cyclops and Wolverine issues still popping up. We see Jean Grey um, uh, being pregnant. So what's that going to lead to? We know what that leads to, but how is that going to play into the series is, is it going to happen during this season uh is she going to have the baby by the end of the season what's the situation there and magneto taking over the school what does that mean and where are they going where are they going to madripoor where are all the places that they're going here uh to explore all the adventures that they've got going on in this one so i like this, this is a great lineup i love the you got a lot of alphas here with storm with beast with uh, Cyclops, with Wolverine, with Jean Grey, 
a lot of people, Bishop, all coming together here. It's going to be interesting to see how much work they get in in figuring out uh, how they work together, but also like the scenes. How many scenes are they going to get? Where are they going to um, uh, find their focus? And how who's going to lead the team at certain moments? Uh, I'm curious to see. But overall, the, the the theme, nice updated theme, works perfectly. Uh, the look of this looks awesome. Where the the what they're pitching to us looks pretty cool. And so at the end of the day, I'm excited to uh, to dive into this season and have some fun with it coming on March 20th. So not that far away way at all literally what just a little bit over a month away from this thing coming out so marvel's having a hell of a week got that uh, deadpool and wolverine trailer that's i think broke all records for 24 hours for views then the fantastic forecast they dropped yesterday valentine's day and by the way if you missed our geek bites discussion last night we it's up on the channel right now me and uh, uh michael vogel shannon mcclellan talking about uh that uh, that announcement and what it might mean and the deadpool and wolverine trailer that's up and i'm sure uh when we do the geek buddy show tomorrow that we're going to be talking about this x-men 97 animated series trailer as well so look for that tomorrow as well what do you think of the trailer did you like it are you into it did you catch little allusions to things from the series that made you excited that they understand what they're doing here the Bo de Mayo and the crew understand what they're doing here or did you want to see more uh did you like the theme did you like the animation style mirroring what we got but still kind of updating it and did you like where we're going here in the series and the cast of characters that they're bringing back to be a part of it? Let me know down in the comments section below. Hit a like on this video, share it on your social media, and hey, more than anything else, please subscribe to the channel down below. And I'll talk to you next time with another brand new reaction video here on the Outlaw Nation. <laughs>